Howdy again everybody. Yeah, I figured I'd make another video. Um, these are all finds that I've made since my last video. I've made more finds than this, but uh, these are kind of the ones that have stuck out in my mind. Um, I found this uh, this old lock the other day at a place out in Battle Creek, Michigan. Same with this lock here and the ring right here. Uh, neat old locks. I found this key out there also. Um, the watch I found out in the woods, it's a Bulova, uh, and this gold plated spoon I found out in Battle Creek too, they're excavating a, uh, about two city blocks. Um, the little ring I found out in, uh, in the woods, uh, as a matter of fact I, when I posted it on the forum it was a complete ring until I was the next day I was fooling around cleaning it and it broke. Ah, what the heck, it's still gold. Uh, I found this uh, Queen Vic uh, dime, no date though. I found that out in Battle Creek. I found these old Model T Ford points out in the preserve. And these uh, two buttons here I found out, uh, out there at Battle Creek. And the cameo I found right next to a cistern that was uncovered. Uh, out in Battle Creek. Um, I found the crucifix silver ring out there at Klein Stuck in the woods. I found this little silver ring in the woods. I found all three of these barber coins here out in the woods in the same week. Um, well, I'll do some close ups here uh, of the good stuff. Yeah, there's a little closer look at the cameo and the, and the jewelry. Uh, that's the first cameo I think I ever found like that. I don't know if that's made from ivory or what. It's carved from something though, but I've never found one before. Pretty neat find. Um, and the buttons and the rings, of course. Yeah, and all three of these barbers I found in the same area that I found those two silver dollars in my last video. Well, I was glad to find these. I like finding them barbers. You know, I found some Mercury's and uh, Roosevelt's since then too, but I, I didn't dig them out. Not much to look at on this Queen Victoria. Uh, all I know is they made them from 1853 or 9 or something like that up till 18 or 19. But uh, it's pretty wore out. Uh, let's get a look. You can see a little bit of the crown on that side. That's yeah, first, first gold-plated silverware I ever found, or actually goldware, I guess you'd call it. I don't know, but uh, I thought it was kind of cool. When I found this, uh, I rubbed it. I was rubbing on it. My brother was watching me as I was rubbing on it. I said, "Man, that thing looks like it's gold." He says, "Nah." I says, look, I never dug up a spoon that looked like this after you rubbed on it. Sure enough, uh, it's got a little insignia there. It says Waldo IF or HE or something. Uh, I'll try and get a closer shot of it here. Ah, the doggone camera don't want to focus. There it goes. There. There it is. Yeah, here's the locks. Uh, I, I like finding these old locks. Especially that small one. That was kind of a neat find. Yale and Town. It's a cool lock. But that's about it. Uh, I'm going to call it quits for the video today. Uh, everybody have a good one. We'll catch you later.